In youth football leagues all over the country, kids suit up in helmets and pads to play tackle football. But the players in one particular league in Utah are unique. An all-girls tackle football league recently kicked off its first season, creating a lot of excitement and raising a few eyebrows. Here's NBC's Joe Fryer. This field in the shadow of Utah's tranquil mountains, ponytails dangling from helmets may be the only giveaway that this is the country's first known tackle football league than sixth grade girls. I don't know, it just gives me like a rush, I guess. Because like hearing like the pads like click always makes me smile, I guess. 12 year old Sam Gordon, a four foot six running back, helped get it started. Three years ago, she graced the front of a Wheaties box after her highlight reel went viral. The video showed Gordon breaking tackles and scoring touchdowns in a full contact league for boys. Don't miss this. But she knew that didn't appeal to every girl. Go, pop your arms. Good job, ladies. So they created a league of their own with room for 50 players. You filled up all the spots in three days. What does that tell you? Uh, it tells me that a lot of girls wanted to play tackle football. Girls like Jonna Tucker. A couple years ago, she documented her dreams in a letter. When I'm 30 years old, I want to be the first female NFL player. You can imagine her excitement when she heard about the league. My mom, she got the email at 6.30 and got, had me signed up by 6.35 because she knew how much I wanted to play. There are four teams. Run straight through that cone, okay? Tessie Mayarse coaches the White Hawks. Like, you can be a girl off the field, but on the field you're a football player, so I need you to be aggressive. This new program comes at a time of heightened concern over concussions. The adults who run the league say all its coaches are certified to teach safer tackling and blocking techniques. And they know all of the safety protocols that they need to implement in order to run a better, safer football league, and they've been doing that brilliantly. That's right. Jonna Tucker's mom knows the risks, but trusts the league. She's doing something that she loves, and far be it from me because I, I have a fear of that happening that I don't allow her to play. What these girls truly hope to tackle are stereotypes. One, two, three, girls tackle football! Joe Fryer, NBC News, West Jordan, Utah.